Stalkers, this is Victor from the Penny Stalker channel and I am very excited to bring you the main watch list for Tuesday, April 13, 2021. If you are new to the channel, please subscribe now. If not, please give it a thumbs up and make positive comments. So I'm very excited to bring you this list. Remember, this is the Penny Stacker channel on YouTube. The best in OTC. And um, one of the tickers that I'm including here has a 10-year agreement. Mm, what could that be? And it's trading at 0014. Okay, guys, so listen. Pay attention here. I hope you're up. And, well, I don't know. I hope you are paying attention. I hope you are watching the video. What's going on here? The first ticker symbol is RGBP. It's called Region Biopharma. It's trading at 0 0.059, had an increase of 116%. And what we got in front of you is three different pictures of three different dates. One is from, uh, where's the date? If I could find it. Um, it's no date. Oh, please. Um, I don't see the date. Okay, anyway, listen, I apologize for that. The one is from on the far right is from today, on the middle is from Friday. And the left is from Thursday. So, in all those days, I have featured this ticker. So, on Thursday, it was about 0 0.01, and it went up 571%. On Friday, it was 0 0.02, and it went up 94%. And, on, um, and then today... It went up to um, 0 0.059, so almost six cents, and it went up 116 percent. And the volume is, um, let me see, 1.9 billion shares were traded. So a lot of shares been traded, and all that is, um, all this movement is in the heels of the next. Um, pictures that I'm going to show you, but I just want you to be aware that these guys, listen, RGBP right now is probably the most exciting ticker symbol in OTC, okay? Um, you can compare it to TSMP, but to be honest, these guys are moving faster than TSMP. The increase is a lot faster. And um, if you're not taking part of this, you are missing out. Simple as that. It should continue going up. Uh, however, I could be wrong. So anyway, uh, what? okay, what I did is, uh, the what is it called? I forgot the name of the magazine. I copied this from Investors, not Investors Hub. I copied this from a magazine, and they tell me that uh, Region Biopharma signed a license agreement. This was signed on um, when a couple days ago, uh, Thursday last week. It came out. Region Biopharma signed a license agreement with Oncology Pharma for the intellectual property pertaining to mRNA messenger RNA to be used in developing a therapy for treating for treating pancreatic cancer. The license IP consists of antigen specific cancer vaccines in which modified mRNA is administered to produce epitos able to produce an immune response which augments the likelihood of successful induction of immunity. An epidot is the part of the antigen that is recognized by the immune system. 
So that's what they uh, they sign a license agreement with the uh, other with Oncology Pharma, right? And Oncology Pharma is trading at like thirty seven dollars. So that's very interesting. And they tell me that uh, okay, so Oncology Pharma deals. It says um, Region Biopharma signed two deals with Oncology Pharma. One is between oncology and region for treating pancreatic cancer. The second is between regions wholly owned subsidiary KCL Therapeutics Incorporated and oncology for the treatment of colon cancer as considered to region for the as consideration to region for the rights and license granted pursuant to the agreement oncology pharma shall Pay to region a non-refundable fee of $55,000, no later than April 20. Pay to region royalties equal to 5% of the net sales as net sales are defined in the agreement. Pay to region 10% of all considerations in the case of any of in-kind consideration of fair market value as monetary considerations. So that's a very exciting um, agreement, license agreement to benefit our GDP. Okay, next sticker symbol is ADGO. It's trading at 0039. It had an increase of 44%. And they are called Avante, Avantigo Corporation. And Avantigo Corporation Formerly Golden Eagle is an enterprise software solution provider. The company provides multi-channel software solutions and manage digital communication solutions. It uses an intelligent solutions platform to integrate the customer data and systems with third-party services to develop customized business solutions. The company offers its services to marketing and advertising firms, among others. It designs and develops solutions for advanced digital communications, centralized product ordering and distribution, advertising promotion, data pen, appending services, social media marketing campaigns, and lead generation and processing. The company also offers enterprise ready solutions for customer management, workflow management, vendor management, order management, and accounting. Its integration hub or Connect2 enables integration of customers' internal servicing systems with data acquired from third party service providers. Anyway, so uh, ADGO is moving very, very fast, up trending, and the volume of, tra of shares traded was 1 billion. So that's why the sticker is in front of you. Next sticker symbol is NUUU. It's trading at 0014. It went up 40%. They are called Rejuvel. And um, the amount of volume of shares traded was 511 million. You can see it's trending upward. And not too long ago, I was covering these guys at triple zeros. So they gave us a chance to be at triple zero five. Now they are three times that. So that's how these things work. And they tell me that Rejuvel Biosciences is engaged in the development, market, entry technology products and services into early and mainstream technology products and services. The company, through its subsidiaries, is focused on developing and manufacturing a line of technology of technologically advanced skin care products and providing environmental management solutions that use electron particle acceleration technology. The company offers Rejuvel 3D, which is an ageless infinity microgravity cell renewal cream. Uh, the subsidiaries are Rejuvel International Incorporated and New Earth Incorporated. So that's what's going on with them.
triple zero no double zero one four new next ticker symbol is q b a n it's trading at double zero one four it had an increase of 27 percent they are called telco cuba the volume traded was 593 million shares you can look at the chart it is trending upward and uh, telco cuba subsidiary uh, here's the news telco cuba subsidiaries advanced satellite system signs a 10-year agreement so this was um released today and they said that uh, um, telco cuba subsidiary advanced satellite system signed a 10-year agreement with the city of hawthorne florida for the use of its current cable television and satellite systems. So um, that's what's going on with this. That was uh, that came out today, and I think that should be a catalyst to bring this uh, to previous heights. I hope you agree with me. So there is the main list for Tuesday. I hope you find it interesting for your decision making very hot tickets on the list and the hardest one is the one on top rgbp which is probably the hardest otc ticker right now ever not right now um, follow me on twitter where um, you can find my twitter information on this picture here where i post alerts news articles and otc OTC related information also I would like you to uh, become a uh, patreon there are two different levels there's uh, the the one level is the list for thirty dollars either the triple zero list or the main list or you can get two lists for uh, fifty dollars and um, you get the list 12 hours before the market opens and when the market opens I am with my patrons on a discord channel where we exchange ideas and information and then they get an upgraded list at 3 o'clock before the market closes and um, audio meeting at 5 or 5.30 p.m. after the market closes so that's a lot for um, 30 bucks, uh, you should consider it. 